You're making a lot of noise there. Anybody ever tell you you're very loud? You're very loud at eating and drinking? Huh? Hello, Super Toe fans! I know it's been a while, but I'm here at the windy, super windy Atlantic Avenue station to start a new series called Take Me Somewhere New! The rules are, I just kind of want you to tell me someplace I've never been before in New York City, someplace cool. Today, we're going to Roosevelt Island and explore that. I know I've been there before, but I only kind of saw the subway and the tram, so I'm going to the park all the way south of Roosevelt Island, for Freedoms Park is what it's called. So, and I'm going to spell new to commemorate the kickoff of this new series. Airline Flyer on Twitter actually made a good point. I said that uh, the Atlantic Terminal Long Island Railroad Station... Yes, yes, yes. One's about to leave. I said that it was built under the intersection of Flatbush and Atlantic Avenue, which it's not under at all. It's... Well, it, you know, walking down, it looks like it runs right along the edge of the Atlantic Avenue Mall structure. Um, and then it curves off here at the end, it looks like, which is what uh, Flatbush Avenue does, too, when it turns into Atlantic. And, of course, the Long Island Railroad goes east from here, so that's what Atlantic Avenue does. So I guess it doesn't really go under the uh, intersection per se, but I'm guessing it all that vibration through the roads from all the traffic up there can't help because apparently they're going to have got some infrastructure work to do on this station even though it's not that old but we're not here for the long island railroad today are we no we're not we're here to ride the subway starting with the n train which will almost certainly be omni just kidding almost certainly be a r46 but it is what it is have i asked what train is missing from that uh, before. Looks like it's the W missing. Weird. Maybe it, I don't know. Leave in the comments. What 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 train is missing? What what do they tape over? I can't quite make it out. Alright, end train is a long walk from here to the end. Here we go. And oh hey, it's a N for not in service. Not gonna ride it. Unfortunately. Maybe I could hop on. Let's open it up, see if I can sneak on. Not really, I'm not really gonna do that. That's not breaking the rules. Nope, it says not in service, and I am not an MTA employee. So, let's ride the end train, which is definitely coming right about no. No. Nope, just the D, and I, you know, when it's a train that I don't need, I don't let it stop. See ya. All right, so now where it comes, now comes the end train. Looks like an R46, and it is. Hey, well, taking this all the way to change to the E at Times Square. Change the E to Times Square to Port Authority, and in keeping with the tradition of R46 train cars, the display, exterior display, is broken. Not completely broken, mind you, but broken nonetheless. Because R46. Some of you ask, why do you hate the R46 so much? It's... Uh, because, you know, it's not that it's a bad train, I guess. I'll say it one more time. This is the last time I'm going to say it. Not that it's a bad train to go. It's a bad train to be in. It is ugly and dirty and old and hardly ever works right. And the intercoms seldom work correctly. You can barely hear what people say. So, yeah, it's being run into the ground. And it should have retired before the R32s, honestly. Because I like the R32s. Still, they still were going strong when they were retired, as far as I know. Anyway, all right, going across the Manhattan Bridge. There's the Brooklyn Bridge. I decided to take the, you know, not look at the road this time. Not quite as uh, good a view as I would hope, but here we are. All right, scooch on down. So we got quite a few stops, but at least we're going express. You know, that's cool. Nice to see the Manhattan Bridge on a nice day in February. Nice sunny day for a change. All that snow recently has got me kind of... Well, I like the snow, honestly, but it kept me indoors. Kept me from riding trains so much, so uh, 
Here we are. Here we are now. No snow. All trains. All day long. Not really. It's just the trip to Roosevelt Island. You guys might be wondering, why did I start this series? Well, just a second. Could transfer to the W here, but I'm not going to. And it's because... I realized that there are a lot of places in New York City that are really cool that I have not been to. And I don't mean the, um, the touristy places like Times Square or Rockefeller Center. Like, I want to go to see some New York City things that I wouldn't normally see. So I've never been to Four Freedoms Park. I don't even know what's there. I just looked on the map and was like, huh, there's a place I haven't been. So that's where I'm going. I'm going to take the tram there too, which I've only taken once before. That was pretty cool. That was a couple of years ago, I think, when I started leaving those uh, window, uh, the win window stickers. Oh, hey. Whoa. Yeah, my dudes are singing the Beatles. Alright. Alright, they're good. They're just like John and Paul, so I'm gonna I gotta pay pay these men. If you see these guys, pay them because they are awesome. Alright. Thank you for that, gentlemen. Ah, that's the New York I like to see. Getting back to normal. Buskers at Times Square. Can't wait for Showtime sometime. Because I don't see as many Showtimes recently, huh? Wait a minute. Are you kidding me? Vermont is advertised made for winter. Hey, New York, has it not been cold enough for you? Go to Vermont. <laughs> it's definitely cold enough for you there. No, thank you. I mean, if you like skiing, which I don't. Guess those guys are repairing the LC, the displays, the uh, monitors, whatever. I don't know if they're putting up new ones or repairing the old ones, but yeah, uh, they seem to be. Half of them seem to be busy doing stuff. <laughs> the other half just sort of chilling. Okie dokie. Here we are, waiting for the E train. Let's. See. You know what? I realized that. It was something that always bugs me about this uh, ACE platform here, or this, I guess, the CE platform anyway, here at uh, Port Authority. The offset of the platforms is insane. Like, the back of this platform is pretty much, touch it, is pr pretty much the same as it, like, touches the back of the, the Manhattan, the, um, sorry, Brooklyn bound platform. It's crazy. Like, the offset of these platforms. I'm not sure why, but there it is. I mean, I had yeah, you got to walk a long ways, just to, even longer, just to get to this, you know, Manhattan and Queensbound platform. Anywho, we're on the E train. That was quick. Happy about that, because we got a bit of a walk to go when we get to the W train, or as I like to call it, the yellow line. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on the blue line now. <laughs> yes, me, an intellectual, on the blue line. Nobody calls it that. Anyway, whatever. Okay, Bronx. Where am I going? Gotta walk it now. There's no transfer available, so I'm gonna have to walk it to the W. Uh, fortunately, I only have to go to 55th Street. I know. Hey, individual. Is there an elevator here? I could. Yeah, I guess there is somewhere. Oh, hey, that's a that's an army duffel. Thank you for your service. Anyway, so gotta go to 55th Street. I know it's 57th Street, 7th Avenue Station, but uh, fortunately, I know there is a station at 55th Street. And you know, I gotta come to Midtown to remember that you know I. I mostly stay around DeKalb Avenue, and they built a ton of new buildings at DeKalb Avenue, so it's hard to, you know, it, it, I forget sometimes what these older Midtown buildings look like in, look like in Manhattan, and they're kind of charming to an extent. And the scaffolding is sprouting from the sidewalk, and it's not even spring yet. Statue of Liberty! 
decidedly not the Statue of Liberty. That's quite a contrast. <laughs> All right, there's an elevator. I don't think this was here before, so I'm gonna take it. I think the last time I came to this station, there was not an elevator here. Okay, new elevator, let's do this. Gotta love the MTA for expanded accessibility. Right on, mezzanine. I probably won't take the elevator to the platform. It still bugs me a little bit how they have to have two separate elevators to go from the street to the platform. Like, actually three, I guess, in this case, right? That's... Oh, Metro card only. Well, that's okay. I got Omni. There you go. Okay, that was that was far less dramatic than I wanted it to be, but whatever. No transfers. That's something you know. One of the drawbacks of Omni, I guess they might fix it someday. Q train is that I can't see the balance on the Omni card after I swipe. It just says go. Or if I don't have the proper balance, it says. Oh, no, I'm sorry, you're not going anywhere. Hey, wait, what the... This is... It's the same not-in-service train we saw at Atlantic Avenue. How crazy is that? Wow. Hello there again. Still not in service, I see. You're not even opening the doors this time, are you? Come on. Okay, there you go. I, I don't know if it's stopping at every station or... Oh, nope. Just an employee taxi, I guess. Okay, well, bye, not in service train that I've seen before again. All right, so we're waiting for the W. This is not it, that's the R. Well, you know what I do with trains that, uh, you know what, I don't let you stop. I don't let you stop because I don't need to ride you. Sorry, all the passengers on the train, you didn't get a chance to get off the train. Just have to come back. Wait a minute, wait, hey, whoa, what's that, yeah. What's the W doing over here? It's supposed to be over here. On the local track. And now it's over here, on the Q train track. Boo! Boo this train! And it's an R46. Boo this train! Oh, and the display doesn't work. Oh, like completely broken. This is Texas. This is the W train traveling on the Q line to 96th Street, making the same stop. If you need to go to the store again, okay. We need to wait for the end train here. End train, huh? So now I have to make a choice. I would what's gonna go two stops on the Q on the W sorry on the W train, and that's the N. What's gonna go two stops and then then do a, then walk to the tram. But I guess I'm gonna have to take the W and walk one stop and walk a little further, huh? The w train will be making Q stops. Q stops. Nice Still a W train. Making Q stops or not. Still a W. Ah, the W train serves no purpose except for to fill the gaps in Q and R train service. Honestly, why is the W train even a thing? Literally just to fill the gaps, the service gaps. They're like, oh, let's just put the W there in the sense there's a Q gap or a B gap, whatever. For transfer, oh, this is the walking transfer that I'm not taking that going up here. I'm going to walking do a walking transfer to the Ro Ro Roosevelt Island tram. Uh, looking forward to that actually. I haven't been on that in a long time. Only once before. In this second, I've shared it with every time I've been on it. I have shared it with you guys. So here we go. I am going to take it for the second time, and you will too. Lexington Ave. Long little walk here, but that's okay. I'm only going to stop for anything that's interesting. Hmm. Okay, take a left here on 59th. Not at 59th yet. There we go. Cross, take a right. I believe this is 59th. Yeah, up. Oh, look at that. There's the stop that I. There's the walking transfer. Right, that was the walking transfer. Wow, that truck just. That truck did not make a wise decision trying to make that red light. Now he's off in the middle of the intersection. All right, 59th Street. Um, the tram should be second Ave, I think. This is third. Can I cross yet? Nope, can't cross yet. All right, I'm gonna cross now. Oh, hey, Trash City, USA. New York, Trash City. Still don't, still, still don't understand that. Like, why? Make, especially with new buildings, like. I, I kind of understand here, there's sort of, 
they need containers, but oh, there's the tram. But with new buildings, like make them have a place to put a garbage bin, a, like a container. Like make them have a place. Put it in regulations. Make them do it. All right. So we're up here at the tr oh no! Oh wait, that's the that's the exit. Gotta go around. And what? Metro card only. You gotta be kidding me. Gotta get out my Metro card. Hope they don't leave without me. Yeah, double swipe. All right, I'm spoiled. Omni has spoiled me. But I guess since the tram is run by a separate entity than the MTA, they didn't feel the need to put Omni here. And I'm not even sure you can transfer. I don't, I'm not even sure it counts as a transfer, does it? Like, you can't transfer for free from the subway to the tram. Whatever. I'm only riding it because it's cool looking. Please hold on. And please continue to wear your mask for the whole ride. I will. And, you know, I, I could. I guess it's because people can take the F train if they want to. This one's just for sightseeing and stuff, right? Yeah, it's a good ride, so I'm not too, too beat up about it. Look at that. Tall buildings. See, like, new buildings like that. They should they should make it, put it in building code that you have to have a room where the container, like a garage-type room where the container is stored that stores the trash for the building. Do not put it outside! Hmm. All right. This is, a, this is nice. This tram is not full, but everybody is sitting, like, sideways on the seats to look out, so there is no space for me to sit. But that's okay. I can I can just sort of scooch around and get some angles where I can. Oh, woo! It's uh the current's running strong today. Look at that. There's still some snow on the ground. Wow. There's some work work barges. Not really barges, but I guess, but they're floats where cranes wonder what they're working on. Okay, looks like we're headed on down. When uh, I should really look into the history of the tram. Hey, doggo! That doggo does not look happy to be with, you know, be going on the tram. There he is. <laughs> anyway, well, here we are. I'm going to turn around and go out the exit. I like that the the, the exit is on is exit is on the other side. All right, cool. Now, now we explore. There's the bridge. There's the Rhode Island sign. Ha, <laughs> just kidding. Roosevelt Island. R-I is the abbreviation for Rhode Island, I think. All right, cool. So, Cornell Campus Subway Shops. More, okay, so the Four Freedoms Park is half a mile. I was going to take the red bus, but I don't. doesn't look like it's uh, a thing. And also, that's going the other way. For some reason, the traffic goes north on the island on the west side instead of south on the whatever anyway it's it's weird to me it's a little bit weird to me that there's a bridge that goes completely like a giant bridge that goes completely over the island does not have an exit onto the island just goes completely over the island it's, it's a weird concept to me like it just the purpose of bridges is to bridge and they just built that one like completely over the island instead of making it go I don't know I get whatever is that an exercise thingy it looks like an exercise thingy geese go back to Canada eh? hey hey go to Canada this is New York you're almost there okay wow this is a nice little area I mean kind of barren I wish they'd do more with it Mmm, looks like it. Not a whole lot of shade. Oh, I'm not alone, people. I am not the only one who decided to come here today. Construction hat, okay. Hey, geese again. Wait, that one's, that one's getting down with some water. Let's, what the heck? You hear that? You hear that? It just like getting is he is that are you drinking? Are you drinking or are you what are you doing? Are you drinking or eating? I can't tell. You're making a lot of noise there. Anybody ever tell you you're very loud? You're very loud at eating and drinking? Huh? Be quieter. Okay. Well <laughs> Well that was that was a thing. Alright, cool. 
South Point Park. Here we are. Park rules. Standard New York City park rules. No personal grills. It's the first one. Nice little path here. Boy, that is, that is a lot of imported rocks. I guess a... Hmm. That's Queens. That's Long Island City. Hey, I can see the Freedom Tower in the distance. Cool. Nice. And this is the service entrance. That was a Pepsi sign, too. We'll get a better look at that later, maybe. And there is a... <laughs> there's a there's a cat sanctuary. Why is there a cat sanctuary on Roosevelt? I mean, it's cool. They're just in there chilling. Look at them. They're just like, yeah, I'm sanctuary. And there's they're like, they got security cameras and everything. They got better security than humans do. Is that the same goose? Is that the goose out? Hey, I feel, I feel like I'm being followed. They're spying on me. I did not know. What is this? I did not know this. No trespass. Well, duh, the structure's unstable. I see that. What is it, though? Oh, it's this. Whoa, that's cool. Smallpox hospi hospital. Smallpox hospital. That is so. I did not know this was here. That is so cool. The building. You, you can uh, you can freeze frame if you want to read about it. Got. That is so darn cool. Wow. I did not know this ruin was here. But it was, it was like, historic site since 1972. It seems like they would have restored it instead of just leaving it as a ruin. I'm not sure why they would, but it's kind of cool. Franklin Roosevelt, Freedom, Four Freedoms. Okay, this, so this is Four Freedoms Park. I'm confused because, you know, I thought I was already in Four Freedoms Park. This is... That is, um, said no climbing. That is, if, if the Shadies were with me, that is literally the first thing they would do, is climb this. That is some poor design for a public park, I have to say. For a public park that's supposed to be family park. I mean, it looks cool, but practically, practicality, uh, not so much. Nice stairs. Look, I mean, everything looks nice, just, um... I don't know why it's, I don't know why they got that big old slope on there. Let's get a better look at the hospital. I don't know what that little tent there is for. I would like a better look at the smallpox hospital, but it's pretty cool. All right, let's head on down the grass. I'm not going to walk on the sidewalk. Grass. All right, well, anyway, I am going to come over here and take a better look at the Pepsi Cola sign, which I am honestly quite amazed that it's still here. I'm, I don't know how long it's been there. But I'm just super amazed that it's somebody hasn't torn it down yet. Everybody thinks it's like, oh, it's a landmark. Yep, that is, that is Frankie D, all right. Hey there, Frankie. Disembodied head of Frankie D. And there's a little, there's even a little island in the south of, like that, that should be South Point Park. South, uh, <laughs> for, anyway. Oh, there's a, this looks like a, making up for bad design honestly i don't think that i don't think this was planned to have a glass door here they put i i don't know who had whatever architect designed this place not uh maybe maybe they shouldn't hire him again or her it looks nice ish but as far as practicality no anyway i'm gonna say goodbye here at this poorly designed park but uh i want you to take me somewhere cool next episode it doesn't have to be from here i don't have to start from here just tell me where to go and i will i will you know suggest a route any route to get there and i'll see what i can do just take me somewhere new take me somewhere cool lots of places i haven't been yet